hey it's the empire don't forget to hit the like button the subscribe button and the bell icon for more videos be taking over let's go champ hit that like button hit that subscribe button right now let's go hey six nine don't be commenting no fuck shit under my pictures boy talking about clown nigga the only thing got a red nose where i'm from is a pit bull bitch ass nigga fuck wrong with you nigga and 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 I get to New York, and I get to New York, New York this week, nigga. Motherfucker, pull up on you, nigga. I ain't one of these rap niggas you be trolling with, nigga. Quit playing with me, nigga. Fuck wrong with you. Yo, so Gotti just hit five million in one day. Six for six on fucking Billboard. You know what I'm saying? And for these pussy ass niggas, what's his name, man? Hey, you're fucking bro. What Yo, bro, I got a hundred K Saturday, you lose the fight. hundred fuck fucking K, man. Fuck it, man. Fuck it, man. Fuck it, man. Matter of fact, bet that 200. Make it 200, Make it 200, blood. 200K. Make it 200, blood. Make it 200, man. What's he talking about, man? 200 fucking K. Fuck this nigga talking about, blood. Man, what you talking about, man? It's new money, man. It's new money, blood. Fucking New York, blood. New money, man. It's my city, New York. King New York, what you talking about, blood? Make it, what? We're making it 200K? Yeah, man. He gonna get knocked out, blood. That's why my brother don't fuck with you, blood. You know what I'm saying? Huh? Huh? We got enough money. You fucking clown, nigga. Ain't you better check in when you come to Brooklyn, nigga. Ain't you better check in, blood. Money team Peace. shit, right? Huh? Peep the shit, blood. Come on, blood. Bro, we got 20k on this shit, man. Put 20k. Matter of fact, that, ma match my three, nigga. Uh -huh. Match my fucking three, nigga. King of New York shit, bud. Huh. Talk Peep that talk, drip, bud. Peep, Peep the drip, bud. Huh. Fuck you talking about, man. Fuck niggas talking about, man. I mean Hey, it's the Empire. Geoboxing Empire. Back to my boxing. Now, man, Adrian Broner and Takashi69, man, they start beefing online. Apparently, uh, Adrian Broner posted something online talking about don't tag him if you're not part of Adrian Broner's promotion on Showtime. And um, he says, A, B, A, B, A, B, <laughs> real quick. And then, apparently, Takashi69 tweets on that uh, post and says, clown, all caps, right? Now, A, B gets all upset, man. He posts his video. You guys seen it in the description, man. And then, man, six nine replies, basically betting a hundred racks that he's that uh, Jesse Vargas is gonna win the fight. And man, it's, it's gotten wild, man. He says he has to check in in Brooklyn first before, before he before he comes, which is wild, man. Now, if you guys don't know, man, Takashi six nine is like one of these big new rappers coming up in the game, man. You know, he has some he has some pretty good singles. You know, they're all, like, number one hits. And um, he has some controversial charges. You know, if you guys didn't know, he has, like, some rape allegation with the kid. And he actually got convicted, which is a pretty big deal. But, you know, I don't know how he got away. But I think he paid off, like, bail or something. He has some kind of fine. But anyway, yeah, man, Adrian Broner and Takai Six Nine are beefing, man. And I think this is good for Adrian Broner's career. I always thought that when Adrian Broner gets emotional doing um, – Doing before his fights, when he gets emotional, he, you know, he does better. And the thing is, the thing is, he's fighting Jesse Vargas, and now the whole world's watching. And Takashi 6 9 he shouted you out. And, um, you know, it's a really big deal. Now, man, this is such a big deal that if you guys don't know, like, hip-hop people are talking about it. Like, DJ Academics, news reporters over there are talking about it. I mean, it's it's everywhere right now. Um, Adrian Boner and Takashi 6 9 uh, beefing is a really big deal. This has moved into hip hop and pop culture and stuff like that. And um, this this is a big deal, man. This is definitely gonna raise the profile of Adrian Broner. This is gonna raise the profile of the whole fight card in general. Now everyone's gonna be watching this fight because I mean it's just it's just a big deal. You know the fight is not until what Saturday, and what today's Tuesday or well, today's Monday. Uh, that's plenty of time before the fight. And believe me, man, it's not going to just stop right there. It's going to keep going back and forth and back and forth between Takai 6 9 and Adrian Broner. So, man, this is going to make the fight even bigger. You know, expect this uh, Showtime event to do at least at least 2 million, man. I think it can do 2 million. I think people are going to be watching it just because Adrian Broner is such a big name. You know, um, who knows, man? Maybe Javante Take Davis might hop in it too. Maybe Jamal Trello might hop in it. We don't know what's going to happen. But all I know is today's Monday and there's like five, four or five days into the fight. And Adrian Bonner is the kind of guy who won't be quiet. You know, Adrian Bonner is really about the life, man. You know, um, he has a lot. Of, he had a lot of charges even before he got big. Like, you know, uh, robbery, assault, robbery, assault, all kind of stuff. He even he even hurt himself. You guys know about Adrian Bonner's uh, suicidal attempts on himself or, 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 or suicidal talk. You know what I mean? So the thing is, Agent Bonner's really about that life. He, he will 
run up on 6'9", man. He's not really as scared of anything. Um, the guy's always catching a charge every year, so he's really about that life. And, um, you know, um, now if you guys don't know, man, a lot of people were saying, you know, this could be, uh, a lot of people said it could be staged and everything. But the problem with that is I've seen, um, like, I've been paying attention to hip-hop culture and whatnot. Takashi 6 9 was, like, beefing with some other guy, Triple Red. And the thing is, uh, Triple Red said he can't come to California or something like that. And then, like, even if that was staged, the fact of the matter is, there are people who ran up on Takashi 6 9 that were random people. And they said, you got to check in. And they didn't check in. And, you know, they ended up fighting. So the thing is, to, it doesn't matter if Boner and Takashi 6 9 are playing around. Someone on the street is going to think that's serious. And they're going to run up from Boner. It could be anybody. It could be anybody. So that, that's the thing. It don't matter if it's stage or not. Uh, random people will think that's real. And random people will react to it. And they're going to they'll, they'll step up to these rappers and say, you heard what he said. You got to check in. And if you don't, you know, basically that's like a fee. If you don't pay that fee, then some random person will run up on you. So I can see it was like a fact. It will happen. So we're going to see what happens, man. You know, I mean, Agent Boren is definitely going to up that security in Brooklyn. It's going to be wild, man. You know, those ticket prices might rise. You guys might see a, a, a short spike in ticket sale prices. And uh, if it didn't sell out, man, it's definitely going to sell out now. You know, um, so let me know how you guys feel about it, man. You know, uh. I mean, everyone's talking about it. You guys see it. You guys see it in the description. DJ Academics is even talking about it. You know, a guy who talks about hip-hop and all that stuff, you know. So this is a really big deal, man. This is not a game. You know, this is this is a big deal. And, you know, I'm really excited for this fight, man. We're going to see what happens. Broner can't lose his fight, man. It'd be the end of him. <laughs> It'd be the end of him. So, you know, Jesse Vargas might be a, a sacrifice, man. I, I know this is going to be a hard fight and everything, but... It's to the point now where Broner's in like life and death situation, and you know if he responds to to Kyle six nine, you know the fact the fact is to really prove to Kyle six nine wrong, you're gonna have to knock out Vargas, man, because the guy say he's he's gonna bet a hundred racks or more on Jesse Vargas to win. So you beating Vargas will make the statement for you. You don't really gotta fight to Kyle six nine. You just gotta beat his guy, and uh, you know. It's gonna it's gonna make Agent Brown look great, especially because he's the main event. He's the main event. He's the last guy fighting, right? So this is a really big deal, man. We're gonna see how everything happens. Um, I'm not sure if this is the last. Um, if you guys have been paying attention to Agent Broner, he has something called what 25-8. He has his own promotion thing going. He could have one more promotion talking about you know um, talking about this beef with Takashi Six Nine and him, which could easily be in in his promotion. Showtime could easily talk about it. Everyone can easily talk about this, man. Everyone can be really talking about this. Like I said, Agent Burner guys own promotion company. So this thing can get a lot bigger than, you know, what people think. Like I said, I mean, that's why I predicted 2 million views at least. You know what I mean? If, if Agent Burner is smart and he pitches on his own promotion and Showtime runs with it, you know, we'll, we'll see what happens, man. I, I easily see this thing getting past 2 million. This is going to be big. Um, this is going to raise the profile of everyone on that card and Burner's career. You know, uh, win, lose, or draw. Hopefully, Agent Broner wins. We'll see what happens, man. Let me know how you guys feel about it, though, man. Do you think the beef is going to actually raise the uh, Agent Broner's fight by by a mil at least a million views or something like that? Because I, I think so, man. He's fighting in Brooklyn. He's fighting in this guy's hometown. Um, Brooklyn's one of the meccas of boxing. Everyone, Everyone's going to be watching this fight, man. So let me know how you guys feel about it. Like, comment, subscribe. This is the Empire. Geo Boxing Empire. Peace. Boxing Empire.